Hey guys, Super Sport 1966, aka Steven. Um, here's another quick tip. Just wanted to show you how I use glue stick um, on my print bed. I've got the glass plate here, no tape on it. I bought a pack of three Elmer's purple glue sticks at Walmart for $2.97. Works great. Benefit of purple, I will show you in a moment. So I've already got glue on the table. Um, and this glue is not worn out. I just wanted to do this for demo, pur demo purposes. Um, but if you accidentally gouge it when you're pulling something off, or eventually it just plain old wears out. Um, I go ahead and clean it off, make the table nice and clean and smooth, make sure there's no debris on it. And as you see here, when I get it wet, it turns purple. It's actually a big benefit, and I'll show you why in a moment. So it's just a wet paper towel. Soften the whole thing and then come back and wipe it off. Now I'm going to let that dry for a second. While it's drying, I'm washing my hands off because I got a little bit on my hands. Okay, so actually I see a little bit more water there. I'm letting it dry. So I've got my bed up to 60 degrees right now, 60C. So it dries pretty quick. Okay, there we go. So here's the benefit of the purple. So I just put out, I don't know, roughly that much. And I just go across the bed here. And as I put it on, it's purple. So I can see where I've hit. I just do a little bit of an overlap. Make sure I've got a coat on the whole thing. I coat the whole surface that I know I'm going to eventually use. And as you can see, it's drying. Um... And the nice thing is, once the purple goes away, you're ready to print. So I know that once that turns clear, it's dry enough to print on. And that's it. That's how I print. I uh, prep my print head, print bed. Sorry. Like I say, I'm running 60 per uh, PLA. And it's all ready to roll. So I just want to share that quick tip with you guys, because I know a lot of you um, wonder how to use the glue with the glass bed. But I'll tell you, when I use this process right here I don't have any failures everything sticks right I'm um, getting it off sometimes after I freshly prep it like this they're a little bit hard to get some things off but if you let the bed cool down before you pop them off that helps tremendously and then I just use my uh, scraper here and I have one here that's got a bevel on the end on one side I put the bevel down and I come underneath the part like that and it pops right off all right thanks again for watching guys